Did you catch this in the Lego movie? Blink and you'll miss the joke. While Emmett is being interrogated by bad cop, take a look at the robots on the computers. One of the robots is playing Solitaire, the go-to game for anyone slacking off at work. Did you know this about A Quiet Place? Actor-director John Krasinski's movie was such a horror hit. It received high praise from the horror king himself, Stephen King. King tweeted, A Quiet Place is an extraordinary piece of work, terrific acting, but the main thing is the silence and how it makes the camera's eye open wide in a way few movies manage. Krasinski said it was the best compliment he received for the movie. Did you spot this in Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban? This incredibly tiny detail is super hard to spot, but it's very cool when you do. Take a close look inside the stone gate the first time we see Hermione confronting Malfoy, and you can see a tiny hand move. This is time traveler Hermione's hand, watching herself in action, before the film has introduced the time travel mechanic. Did you miss this in The Batman? Keep your eyes peeled at stately Wayne Manor and you'll find a bust of William Shakespeare. This refers to the Shakespeare bust used in the 1960s Batman show. Bruce would lift up Shakespeare's head and press a button to open the entrance to the Batcave. Did you see this in Megamind? There's a joke hiding in the background of this scene. After Roxanne learns that Megamind has been lying to her and he insists, I can explain, one of his famous No You Can't posters appears in the background. Did you see this in Hotel Transylvania? In the scene where Mavis walks on the ceiling of her bedroom, we see an odd portrait of a beautiful young woman. That young woman is none other than the voice of Mavis, Selena Gomez. Did you see this in Encanto? In the song We Don't Talk About Bruno, while Dolores sings and dances with Mirabelle, pay attention to the second floor in the background. Bruno is lurking with glowing green eyes. Did you notice this in The Atom Project? Take a look at the shirt Lewis Reed's student is wearing. Notice anything strange about it? It shows a picture of Nicolas Cage, but has the name John Travolta under it. The shirt is a reference to the film Face Off, in which John Travolta assumes the identity of Nicolas Cage's character by changing his face to match. Did you catch this in Soul? The sign for Nine Inch Nails at the hardware store may seem typical, but also two of the movie's composers, Trent Reznor and Atticus Ross, are members of the industrial rock band Nine Inch Nails. Did you know this about Thor? While filming the banishment scene, director Sir Kenneth Branagh told Sir Anthony Hopkins to improvise his reactions. The performance was so strong he left many in the cast and crew in tears. When complimented by Tom Hiddleston later, Hopkins gave all the credit to his director Branagh. Did you see this in Uncharted? When Nathan arrives for his bartending job, there's a neon sign on the wall that says, Kitty got wet. This is a saying used by Nathan Drake in the video game series when he kills enemies. Kitty got wet! Did you catch this in Deadpool? After Wade and Vanessa play skee-ball, they trade in their tickets for prizes. Look closely in the background and you'll see a large red stuffed dog behind the counter. This is a nod to Dogpool, an animal version of Deadpool from an alternate universe. Did you see this in Coda? Take a close look at this piece of paper while Ruby is studying her music. This symbol right in the center is a coda, a symbol used in music to send the song to the end.